Greetings from Multnomah University. I'm Dan Lockwood, Multnomah's president, and welcome to another conversation with Dr. Dan. For the last several months, I've been talking to you about institutional core values, Christ-like spirituality, biblical centrality, academic excellence, and so on. Today, I'd like to talk about our eighth core value, which is global mission. This simply means that we promote a missional perspective of God's work in the world today by encouraging persuasive communication of the gospel and commitment to global ministry. This core value has been part of Multnomah for 75 years. And embedded within it is the assumption that every child of God should be committed to God's global enterprise in some way. For many of us, it's understanding what God is doing in the world, and He's doing some amazing things. For others, it's committing to support missions and mission organizations through prayer or through giving. And for others, it's following God's call to actually go cross-culturally, either as short-term missionaries or career missionaries. Every year at Multnomah, we have a global ministries conference. We had one last February, in which we try to instill these values in our students. And it's exciting to hear them get excited about what God is doing and for some of them to commit themselves to global ministry. We are committed to men and women who understand the gospel and who are able to verbalize it and to take it there. We also want people to be committed to missions. One of the things I'm excited about is that we are bringing on a new member of our faculty, Dr. Greg Birch, who will give guidance to our undergraduate intercultural studies program and is also developing a master's program for us. Dr. Greg Birch is a Multnomah graduate. He and his wife have invested over a decade in Central and South America. He is fully credentialed, but most importantly, he has a heart for the lost and a desire for students to be equipped in unique ways to minister to the gospel. We have graduates who are literally serving Christ around the world. I like to say that we have graduates on every continent except Antarctica, and maybe we'll have one there. Would you pray for our students, our alumni, who are serving Christ in a variety of cultures, using a variety of methodologies, that they would be encouraged and would be effective in their ministries today?